All right, hello and welcome. I'm Gak, this is Arts and Craft with Gak. I'm hanging out with my buddies again. Perfectly. Um, with Kevin here and Greg. And this one is a very rare game, Changes. So um, tell me about how long did you get it? How long ago did you get it? Oh, uh, I got this a couple months ago with a bunch of other games. Didn't really pay attention to it when I got it. Um, did a little research and found out it's kind of a rare, interesting game. So there's like maybe to, three in existence or yeah, something. Yeah, <laughs> trying to bring it back. Um, so far, so good. But except for the CRT, we had to put an LCD in it for right now. Yep. Do you get some gameplay going? And uh, Greg, so you you uh, you actually helped get the game running too, right? A little bit. A yeah. little bit. Yeah. yeah. You you uh, mess with the circuit board, but then you had to send it out, I guess, right? Yeah, it had these little t small solders for the uh, CPU socket that. It's not my thing, so. Right. <laughs> so what's weird is it's like a, a vertical scrolling Pac-Man type game. It kind of reminds me of, uh, what is that, Junior Pac-Man, right? Junior Pac-Man yeah. scrolls left to right. This one scrolls up and down. And uh, you're basically a caterpillar, and you pick up power pellets, and you get the bugs that are trying to attack you, yeah, right? <laughs> and, and little bridges that change when you walk Oh, that's over. right. And you actually get a lot of bonus points for that, too. I yeah. found that out when I played it. If there's a bug coming across it and you change the thing, it the gets lane, like 800 yeah. points for it or something. So, um, but yeah, so you basically become a, a butterfly when you clear the level out. And uh, so, here you want to hold this for a second. So, <clears throat> the beer I got for this one is, I got a mic here, um, is by Moonraker. And it's called Papillon, which is French for butterfly. So, nice. you turn into a butterfly in the game. So why not, right? Um, so it's a hazy IPA. I don't even know. Can you even read what the alcohol is on that? It's probably seven or eight percent. So I'm gonna go ahead and crack it open. 8.5 ABV. 8.5, so nice solid double IPA. I can smell it from here. It smells pretty good. There you go. You get scared of the cat pee, so you get a you get a half pour. <laughs> and I'm gonna. Go IPAs are gross. <laughs> and I'm gonna pour mine in here. So again, Chris has never worked at a bar either. Clearly. Yes, obviously. Eh. So it's nice and cloudy. Um, what Moonraker is just maybe five miles from here or something like that. Pretty close by. Rome was really nice. So uh, cheers, guys. Cheers. So, all right. <laughs> yeah, it's good. I think it's good. It was canned about three weeks ago, I think. Um, yeah, so uh, I don't know. I played a couple games of this. I think I might have beat your score already. Probably. It was like 40,000 or so, something like that. What was it? I got 46,000 points was my game. I already recorded a game. Yeah, I think I got a, you might be the world champion now. Yeah, I might be. No, yeah. I got, no, I got a screenshot of 78. Oh, 70. Nice. All right. So, um, uh, what was I going to say? Yeah. So, it, when you got the machine, it didn't even have a monitor in it. So, these guys worked for probably an hour and a half earlier trying to get a, monitor, a CRT monitor working in it, but uh, it just didn't want to sync up. So... All right, with any luck, we'll get this monitor in there, right? Yeah, baby. Right. We'll get it figured out at next some point time. next time. Yeah. But but he had a um, LCD screen you could pop in, which is a it's actually an arcade LCD monitor, right? Yeah, it's my edge monitor. So okay. So, but yeah, it worked. So. Cool. All right. 
Yep, so, okay, well there we have it. I played already, so I'll cut to that. I showed some shots of the inside of the cabinet. I'll show some of that. Uh, what was kind of weird, the, the, was the power supply weird you were talking about? Yeah, the power supply. I was holding the mic over right there. Also, yeah. So what was it about the power supply? It's just right before the board. It's it's not on the bottom. It's mounted up, you know, a card interface before between the board and the wiring harness. And then there's other some looks like a resistors and stuff on the side wall. Just That's just kind of sketchy. Just laying out there, yeah. Yeah, it sounds a little sketchy. <laughs> and it opens up like a Pac-Man, which is a kind of strange thing for the. Uh, to put the monitor in. Yes, because the whole front folds out, right? Yeah. yeah. It's Bizarre. Gonna, it's going to chomp at you or something. <laughs> nice.
All right. Well, there we go. So again, uh, Papillon by Moonraker, double IPA. So cheers, everyone. Woo.